Hey guys, what's up? This is me, Sean from TechJetOps.com, YouTube.com, so Pete, and today I have a how-to today um, for you guys on how to get the Nexus 7 2013 Wi-Fi only model. Um, if you're having uh, playback issues, video playback issues, um, I was reading a few forums and uh, couldn't really find out the issue, but uh, I just kept doing more research and was able to find out um, it a fix um it's worked so far for me i've only tried it for like the past half an hour but um i heard that this is one way to quick fix it um there's two ways the first way just reset your device uh turn it off press power off turn it back on and you'll more than likely get it to refresh um actually there's three the second way is clear the cache i've not tried that yet but um you can try that def especially if you're having issues um, and these two other ways aren't solving it, but one way that I did find to immediately solve it is if you guys go into your settings right there scroll down to About tablet um, This if you guys don't have developer um, Options enabled. This is how you enable it. You go to model number You click on this and Click on this a bunch of times and I already have it enabled so I don't think Oh, excuse me, um, build number, I'm sorry. And you click on this a bunch of times. I already have it enabled, as you can see, no need. You're already a developer. Um, but uh, you click on it, I believe it's like eight times or something like that in succession. And it'll open up this extra option down here in uh, your system in the settings menu. And it's called developer options. So you click on that. Um, I turned them off for the video, but it, as soon as you turn, as soon as you enable it, it'll turn it on by clicking uh, the build number. You scroll down to, um, scroll down to media, and you click Hughes Awesome Player. You click that, and you click Turn On. And uh, as you can see now, it's on. Um, I think it gives you like a little prompt window box and you just got to click OK. And that'll turn it on. Instead of a new player, which is the default player. And the reason why this is happening, um, from what I've read, is I guess the way um, the software is set up on the, on the Nexus 7. Um, the, there, there's instances where you're trying to replay a video and I guess the device loses track of the location of the video player um, where like the the connections and like where the video player is actually stored in the software so there's no video player to play back the video so that's why you get the um, the error message so anyways uh, you just click on a video I'll pick, click on my uh, wireless charger unboxing and there you go. Hey guys, Starts playing. You can everything works like normal. You can watch it in 1080p if you want. Put on full screen. Everything should work after you enable that. And if it's not working again after this, just do the opposite and enable um and disable that player. So, anyways, guys, this is me, Sean from TechJetOps.com. You to come to St. Pete, and this is a quick fix for the Nexus 7 2013 Wi-Fi only model on how to get videos playing. Thank you for your time. Um, please like, favor, subscribe to my channel and the video, and I uh, hope you guys have a nice day. Goodbye.